and go. Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Walkthrough Wednesday here at Walnut Ridge Family RV Sales. Today we're going to highlight the Cooter 25 RES fifth wheel behind me. So if you're that camper that's looking to upgrade from a travel trailer but feel like the fifth wheels are maybe much too large, too long, too heavy, this is the one that's going to put all out the rest for you. At 7,530 pounds, the 25 RES Cooter half ton fifth wheel is designed for that half ton pickup that you already have. Come on inside, let's take a look at some of the extra features. This unit obviously it sets itself apart from the travel trailers is the fact that the ceiling height is so much taller. So therefore a taller ceiling height allows for a much taller slide out height as well. So when we're getting up from our dinette table or from our theater seating that's set across from our television, we don't have to worry about that consciousness of are we gonna hit our head or just crouching down. So very convenient, very nice. Um, we don't feel that. Also, you have the big, huge windows that's in this slide out as well, allowing a lot of that natural scenery that you desired to go see inside. So beautiful layout there with the big windows with the blackout shades. Again, you've got another big window across the back as well, allowing for more natural lighting, which also lends to the feel of how big this unit is in a 27 foot footprint. Also at 36,950, this is a very affordable fifth wheel. I know oftentimes we associate fifth wheels with these big astronomical prices that are really out of our budget. This fits in a lot of folks' budgets, so you're gonna to wanna to come out and take a look at this for yourself. Nice big television, as I mentioned before, directly across from your theater seating. You have the electric fireplace, can also be used as ambiance if you just want the glow or the light, um, just to keep this area dim and just the TV on. You have a residential stainless steel front refrigerator in this, so much greater capacity than what you'll typically find in most of your travel trailers that have the smaller six or eight cubic foot refrigerators. You have a nice uh, range and uh, oven as well that has the window. Um, also, you have the glass top, which can extend your countertop space, or you can fold this up out of the way. We've got a nice little backsplash, keeping those things that may splatter up against the wall and less clean up when we're done cooking. Beautiful cabinetry, um, this white gloss with this rubbed uh, antique stain um, in the uh, creases here is it's just a beautiful, it's just a very residential touch, nice big grab handle pulls, not the little small knobs, and they didn't go chintzy here. This is really nice hardware that you see in all the cabinetry. Again, you have all of the LED lights um, or, or like your recessed lights that you find in most residential, residential homes, excuse me, not these camper lights that you find that seem to be uh, oblong and just, just look camper and look cheap. We step up into the bedroom bathroom suite area. You have a beautiful walk-in shower, glass doors, um, plenty of space to step out of the shower as well to be able to dry off and get ready for the day. Plus you have the set tee in the shower as well and a small package like this, that's a really nice feature. And in the bedroom, you're gonna have your traditional queen bed. We have tables on either side of the bed. We have ports and plug-ins on either side of the bed as well for CPAP, cell phones, whatever you like to charge in the evening time, you could do that. Um, we're also wired and framed for a second air conditioning. It is equipped with one, but in a small unit like this, if you wanna go down south where it's much warmer this time of year and you need a second AC, one can be added to show you, should you choose to. Wardrobe slide with drawers. One of the things that you typically find missing in a lot of these smaller bedroom areas is drawer space. So we have drawer space, plus we have the hanging space, in addition to the hanging spaces on either side of the bed. Hey, thanks for your time today on the Walkthrough Wednesday. Hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you reach out to us and set your appointment to come out and take a look at this for yourself. We look forward to meeting you. Bye-bye.